One of my favorite things about teaching in the district is the fact that we have the ability as teachers to use our own creativity and our own skills at sharing with our students. You get to teach your style, your, t your teaching style is important. Be yourself, share your enthusiasm, share your passion, share your commitment to what you're sharing with your students. And when you have that relationship with the students, that's when the students will have a relationship with the learning. There's a lot happening in, in our classroom. The kids uh, are engaged with hands-on opportunities. They're having a blast, they're having a great time. And I'll have students say, wow, Mrs. Woodard, I never would have understood this had I not had my hands on it. The kids have so much fun, but they are, it brings the learning home. They are learning more because they're experience, experiencing it with their hands. I call it a sticky, messy learning. <laughs> I think what makes me a good teacher is because I love, I'm just a passionate learner. It's one reason I love to teach so much is because I love to learn so much. And I'm always trying to learn and learn new things and see things from different perspectives. And when I learn these things, I want to share them. I like to teach kids and I like to teach adults and I like to teach my friends. Um, I just love to teach. I really try to change the way I teach every year. Um, I know that I can always improve because I've met other teachers that are phenomenal and I get ideas from other teachers all the time. Obviously, I always want to get better and so I'll, I'll continue to look for ways that I can get better and I know I can. You can always improve your profession and that's what's so great about this profession is that we all help each other do that. chosen as the Rockwall ISD Elementary Teacher of the Year had, is this amazing honor that you, you can't put the feeling into words. This is, this is a um, really um, blessed district with this kind of quality education happening in the classrooms. And then, then they say your name and you're, what? what, did you see all those people up there? How are, how are you saying my name right now, you know? Uh, when I heard my name called, it was a lot of excitement, a lot of joy, along with just a, a tremendous humbling feeling um, that, I would, that I won. I think Teacher of the Year, just winning that means that uh, people have recognized that I am in this profession because I'm passionate about kids and I'm passionate about helping them improve as people and uh, learning their content and just growing. Driving the car around town has been an experience because you, everyone knows who, where you are. You get text messages and calls and things from people. Oh, how is, oh yeah, I see you're having tacos because you're at Taco Casa. Oh, I hear that. How's the dinner at so-and-so? And what are you doing at the Bail Bonds parking lot? I'm not there. I'm at Coal Mountain <laughs> Barbecue. So. The car is amazing because it gets 60 miles to the gallon. I get honked at a lot and, and it's a lot of thumbs up and... Um, a lot of just congratulatory smiles and uh, waves and things like that. And and uh, just kind of soak it all in and enjoy the moment. My two-year-old son, he recognizes it. He loves it. Like, he gets excited every time he gets in the car. My 13-year-old daughter, she's a little too cool for school. So when she rides in the car, she kind of pulls her hat down and uh, doesn't want to be recognized. <laughs> Thank you.
Brandon and I are both members of the Rockwall ISD Education Foundation Board now, so we get to participate in some Education Foundation activities, and I'm really looking forward to that as previous grant winners. I know how, how um, important those are to teachers. I'm looking forward to being part of that board, and there's several other opportunities that are coming out of being the District Teacher of the Year that I look forward to all those opportunities as well. I'm just surprised that it's me that's representing the district, but I'm so honored by the experience. As a one teacher of the year, I've had lots of people come up to me, and so many people have either had great things to say about their teacher, I had a great teacher that had an amazing impact on me, and that's why I'm doing what I'm doing today. Or, in some cases, people will say, I had a teacher that said this to me, and it killed my dream, and I didn't pursue what I wanted to do, or I never saw myself the same way because of some words a teacher told to me that hurt my heart. And so it's just been, and I've, I think we all know this, but it's been impressed upon me even more the immense power that every teacher has in their classroom to have a tremendously positive, positive effect on a student or to have a tre tremendously negative effect on a student. And so just to use this power that we have to really change lives, to change them for the better and be very aware of the fact that we can change them uh, for the worse and to do everything we can uh, to, uh, to be a positive influence. Hey, let's take this thing mudding. Woo!